Hoggy, good to see you back down at Grace Road once again. Um, what, what, what are your thoughts on, on the 2019 season for the Foxes? Oh, 2019's got to be warmer than today because it's absolutely bolting. Um, but the only way is up, isn't it? Um, but it's exciting times. Every pre-season, every year, brings around new opportunities. Um, just seeing Nico has been working out really hard with the, with the lads um, during the winter. So hopefully there's going to be some good news and we get off to a, a better start from last year get on a bit of a roll and positive things coming out of Grace Road next year It was a good season for cricket all around especially for, from a national point of view obviously with England winning the uh, the World Cup in the middle of the year um, from that a lot of participation and the engagement grew throughout the game how good does it seem to see youngsters getting into the game and, and increasing the engagement with it yeah massive important for the national side to do well um, to draw the World Cup twice um, but win that and then draw the ashes and lose that it was brilliant it got people talking about um, cricket we had a national hero who's Ben Stokes who showed great calm and collective um, in the World Cup final and then again um, at Headingley in the ashes and then the emergence um, uh, uh, the bowler that I've now forgotten which is really annoying um, Joffrey Archer coming in that bowled that super over what an absolute how do you come in in your debut season and bowl a super over at the home of cricket in the World Cup final and do it with such a plum that he did um, it was brilliant so anybody that's talking about cricket you get to see people playing on the streets because the national side's strong and it's exciting times hopefully we can have an exciting winter and uh, England can go on we've got a new coach in Chris Silverwood so to try and turn the test format around but then we've got brilliant they've got T20 coming up um, and that 100 ball over competition coming up so there's there's lots of talking points around cricket and hopefully we can get a lot more people coming down to watch and participate in it next year and that's just it obviously as a club we're trying to jump on the back of that introducing our new 99 pound membership for adults and, and under 12s go free as well so how important is it that they come down to their local county and, and strengthen their position. Yeah, I've got to say, 99 quid for the, the season is nothing. Uh, and to come down here um, to watch a T20 game on a 50, 50, 50 over game when there's an atmosphere, when it's packed, when there's lots of stuff going on, it, it's amazing. It's great value. Um, some fantastic cricket being played as well. We've got a world record holder in, in the side. Um, and again, T20 is so fast, so furious. It takes one person to put in a performance to win the game. And if you get on a roll, who knows where, where it could lead to. I remember 2000. 2010 when we won it um, we, we we always have expectations about doing well but we never never thought we'd get to to win it so it could be the Foxes year and it just as I say it takes one or two people to win a game of cricket in T20 so come down support them and 99 quid for for a whole season is absolute peanuts you beat me too. I was going to mention also <laughs> Colin Ackerman's world record, but also got Hassan Azad who who came to the four last year in his debut season, finished the year highest top highest run scorer in Division Two. So you not only got Ackerman, you got Azad, and then obviously the rest of the team around him. There's definitely a reason to come down and watch the Fox. Always a reason. Um, hope, desperation. <laughs> now, yeah, to, go, to to be fair. It, to get a, a step on the on a ladder to, to to overturn a a period where you haven't done well for a long period of time is always hard. Um, but look at Leicester City; they won the championship, <laughs> the Premiership, um, when everybody wrote them up. They won it against Arsenal, against Manchester City. They won the Premiership from absolutely nowhere. Who knows? It could be Leicester, um, Leicester County Cricket Club season. It could be the time that they do something that they win the T20 or, or put in some performances. And why not? Why, why miss it? Especially for that low sum of 99 quid.